This is the most beautiful beach in Sharmashik and you can access it with five euros. Let me tell you more about it now. So let's say you rent an apartment. By the way, if you want to rent an apartment in Sharmashik, contact me on EgyptMadeEasy.net. But you don't have direct access to the sea. You can come here and enjoy this beauty. Look at this. This is the entrance of Farsha Cafe, the most iconic and beautiful cafe in Sharm el There is a video in the channel because at night it's absolutely superb. Now, the first thing when you get here, you see, if you want to go to Farsha, you go on the left because if you go right, that's temple. You see, he's coming already and he's trying to, to take us there. Let's see what this guy is saying. We want to go to Farsha. I mean, maybe temple is good. I don't know, we don't know that. Yes, man, thank you. You see, he's coming for Farsha because this guy is calling here. Where to go? Where to go? We go Farsha. So there is a war going on between the two. I was telling you this is the most beautiful beach in Sharm el-Sheikh. Why? First of all, we are in a bay. There is not strong winds like in other areas. You have incredible corals. Many people come here to snorkel. And at the same time, you have a sandy beach. Usually you get either the sandy beach or the coral. Where are you, my friend? Hello. How much is the ticket? 100 Egyptian pounds. 100 Egyptian pounds, guys, is, uh, is like uh, 5 euros. Thank you very much. This is a place, bean bags, chest longs, and this incredible, oh! That's Ina and that's my sister, by the way. And that's Dylan. The bar. Here you got some of the best hotels in Sharm el Sheikh. Just Farana over there, Reef Oasis Beach, and then Farana, which is exactly up here. If you want to book Farana, by the way, if you want to book the hotels, contact me on EgyptMadeEasy.com. Now, the cool thing here, I generally suggest my clients, especially those staying at the hotels where the beach is not that good, is to come here for the full days. Thank you very much. So basically what you do, if you come at Farsha Cafe at night, sometimes it's so full, they won't accept you. What I suggest to people, you come here for the day, you come here in the morning, you pay five euros, you stay here, you sunbath, they have food as well, you will see later, you can drink a beer, and then as the sun sets, you get up to the most beautiful cafe in Chamishi. Now, let's go to swim, first of all. All right, let's try these fruits. What is this? Mm. Thank you. Wow. Now, as I was saying before, why I love this beach. First of all, there is sand. You see my sister playing here. So, you know, if you cannot swim that well, you want to just chill by the beach, there you go. You don't need water shoes because there is no rocks. It's so cool to come in and you can just chill on one of these. You see these guys are having a beer over the mattress. Uh, I mean, I look at the view behind you. At the same time, you can snorkel and we'll go right there in two minutes. Oh, this is cool. They got a boat as well. We're now going to snorkel. You have two options. Either you walk that way and you get on the pier or you swim over the corals. Just be careful. So we're now on the pier. It takes three minutes from Fasha to get here. Not a big deal. But you know, what we're gonna see down here is gonna pay off. For those who don't know, Farsha is a boho chic cafe. You have all these little elements, which actually you can buy as well. You will find this basket full of items. And so the overall vibe is chill, see, relaxing. You love it daytime and nighttime. Oh, after this snorkel, what we really need is a drink. And as you can see around me, all the people are eating. There are chips, pizzas and beer. So this is the menu. It's pretty cool. That is it. We got a bit of everything, so uh, we'll see now what we order. So guys, that's what we've got. The pizza is coming as well. There are some french fries. Oh, we'll fry that one. But I mean, they're good, nice colors. Fresh beer, in a Coke, some nuts. How's the juice? It's good. So, I mean, you can spend the whole day here, eat, enjoy the beach, waiting for the sunset. 
the best place in Sharm. I've noticed before these floating, uh, I don't know how to call them, chaiselongs, bananas. So uh, for, let's try one. Thank you very much, man. You're welcome. Thank you, Rob. Who wants to try first? Bye. I think you can go together as well. Is it comfortable? Yeah, I want to try that as well. To stay here the whole day but i've got things to do so i asked for the cheek and as you can see we paid the entrance for the beach is like five euro per person then we got some more items and we paid like 40 dollars which is brilliant considering we ate we drank and we got the beach but again i mean if you just want to use the beach you pay your five euros uh, let me know what you think and if you want to book a place at Farsha, I will write down in the comments uh, all the address you can book before. If you need any excursions or hotel in Sharm el Sheikh or in Egypt, contact us at egyptmedisi.net. And if you want to know more about Sharm el Sheikh, watch this video.